Alrighty, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and MK Central is back, and today's a very big day in the Mario Kart world. No, it's not because of the Lounge Season 5 starting later tonight, but it's because we are back with some MK Frontier winner's final gold bracket action between Secret X and John Messiah. And before we get into these two teams, I'm Josh K. Happy to be back in the booth with you guys. And alongside me, uh, he spells his name with a Y, that is Miles. Good afternoon, man, and welcome to the booth. Good afternoon. Happy to be here. Happy to check out some dual inward POV action with our John Messiah and Secret X uh, match today. I think it's going to be a really interesting match. Uh, it's going to be really good to see kind of um, where these teams stand with each other, especially because they're super, super close in skill. And just if you look at the roster, you know, you can kind of see that it's almost an even matchup. So it's going to be a really interesting match. Yeah, one, one thing I noticed right away is LMDS, who's going to be our PMV, POV today for, for the French side. He was on Secret X last season, so he's back with his, his France counterparts. Uh, so he's just, he, he, you know, they made the semifinals with Secret X in D1 last season, but now he's back. He's, uh, he's no longer with the team, so we'll see how he, how he fits in with, with the new team. Um, John Messiah, who, as far as I know, they're a combination of JPP and Ooh, is that... Do you have any other anything else you want to say about them before we get into it? Yeah, I'd say it's like JPP, U, and uh, RE that that's kind of making up John Messiah. But I think it's it's been a group that that has kind of been playing with each other as a a sub clan, I think, for for a little bit. But they kind of decided to make the leap and uh, become an, an official team. So it's going to be really interesting, especially because LMBS is going to be speaking a completely different language in. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> in, in in the war call. So I wonder how that's gonna gonna affect everything, but I'm I'm sure it'll be perfectly fine. Yeah, and uh Secret X having making a good run last season actually got a game off a of world friend in that semifinal. Uh this lineup is full of players who have gotten plenty of uh plenty of experience in the World Cup this summer that we that we so much enjoyed just last month. Uh we had John playing for Team Canada, we had Varro playing for uh, Team K in the UML, so shout out to him, but also, more importantly, playing for Costa Rica in the World Cup. Uh, Roberto yeah. for the U.S. and Reese for Team England. Uh, so this team is very, very stacked, and they, um, they're they going for this gold bracket win. Not, not This isn't the championship game today, but winner of this game is one win away um, from winning the, uh, the gold bracket here in MK Frontier. Yeah, and it looks like each team has kind of brought out their best, so it's going to be a really interesting matchup to see kind of which team will come out on top? So uh, yeah, if you if you wouldn't mind, I'd love to take a look at the uh, the lineups one more time so I could kind of read off. Yeah, so we have Scartax, LMDS, another inward POV, Saru, uh, another inward on <laughs> on John Messiah, JB, Falso, and Pontutera rounding out the the team for John Messiah. Whereas Secret X has Darky, Varro, John, JP Givener. Uh, Roberto, another inward, and uh, Reese, our inward POV for today, and Drac from from Spain. So I think it's gonna be really interesting. There's uh, two inwards on each side, so I think that's gonna be really fun to watch for sure. It's always fun to kind of watch those those different types of metas making yeah. making their way into the game. Yeah, Reese. Uh, speaking of the inward, did make his way to to being grandmaster and lounge number one for a little bit, and so for all the inward doubters out there, I think he kind of silenced them. Um, but it has been a little while since it's been up the top, so maybe uh, maybe it has something to prove here today with with this team. And uh, I, you know, I like to do this all the time with my uh, in the cast that I do. You know, do you have a, a bold prediction for us today that you'd like to like to share? I don't want to come off as too biased, but <laughs> you know, I I kind of have. I I kind of want to see BRE as as the underdogs for today. You know. I, it's it's always fun to kind of see like the newer teams really proving themselves right off the bat. So I think that's going to be really interesting if we can if we can kind of see a, a John Messiah win <laughs> as kind of like their first you know tournament win. So that's going to be interesting. What yeah, do you that'd think? Be, that'd be a good one for one. It reminds me of when Inflow made it to all the way to the winners finals a cup against in Agility, I think it was, or maybe it was, yeah, I forget the name, but they a similar story there. Mm -hmm. So. Uh, in terms of like predictions, you know, just to just to make it interesting, I'll, I'm gonna put my money on Secret X winning it, uh, winning it by like 18 to 20. So, 
Yeah, um, sounds good. Cool. Yeah, I, I definitely, I definitely predict a close match for today. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be a fun one for sure. Yeah, and uh, let's see. Some of you are asking if this is a best of three. It is not a best of three. Uh, the loser will be going to the losers finals um, for a chance to come back to play the winner. It is double elimination, so you lose twice. Once you lose twice, you're out. So these teams have yet to lose. They've won four games to get to this point. So this is the best of the best at the moment here for this okay. Frontier tournament. Yeah, casting a rest of three is definitely tiring. So I have to say, for, <laughs> you wouldn't for know my... anything about that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> for my for my sake, I think it's it's fun to just be watching the the one match for today, because uh, yeah. you know each each team kind of has to really pull out all of the stops and, and everything to to kind of really make it work. Like they don't have two more matches to rely on to uh to bring out the win. So for sure, and you have your plenty of experience doing best of threes, including. Let's see. You did uh you did the Mexico Japan match. I'm sure you did other ones as well uh, in the World Cup. I did the the um I think it was World Friend and RE for uh, uh, MKU yeah. finals last season. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that one was that one was fun. That one was really fun to watch. <laughs> All right. Well, it looks like we're we're starting right now. Yeah. And it is good to have a a partner in the booth. Uh, I did the England France game by myself for the first game. That was <laughs> that was an experience. So thanks oh, for anyone man. who tuned into that. But yeah, so it's good <laughs> to have somebody with me. Um, if you were scared to be just me by myself, it's not. So uh, you're welcome. <laughs> so. Oh man, I could not imagine doing it by myself. <laughs> a lot of a lot of talking to myself. <laughs> yeah, it is. Uh, it is what it is. We're going off looking at LMDS's POV as they pick the first track. Uh, reminder: John Messiah's tag is BRE, so I think we might say Bree a lot. Uh, that's just what we might naturally start saying. So that yeah, is fine. what John Messiah is. Bree like the cheese. Love it. <laughs> so yeah, picking RWS as they are hosting. So RWS and TM for for kind of opposite picks, which does make sense. I do see a lot of that with uh, teams that are that are hosting and teams that are you know not. So yeah, for sure. And uh, but SX getting their pick, so kind of neutralizing that host advantage. So it looks like a top four maybe for Bree. Oh man, so that's unfortunate starting at TM. Yeah, looks so like uh, SX might be able to pull shrooms here, so we'll see kind of how, how it works out. Yeah, so here we go. We got the gold bracket winner's final. Bree, also known as John Messiah versus Secret X, starting off. And uh, we are now underway, watching back to, to Inwards. So if you like Inwards, you're in for a treat today. <laughs> Not really something that you see every day, two inward, two inward POVs, so that's going to be exciting. Now we got yeah, Reach. Uh, looks like looks like a lot of SX in the front already, which is kind of expected on TM as kind of the bottom spots are, are expected to, to pull shrooms and everything. All getting trailed out. It's unfortunate. Yeah, it looks like False I was able to keep first for Bree, but other than that, uh, looks look like a couple SX in the back, so they're right behind them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks yeah. like some mixed spots right now. Yeah, TM, one of, you know, a fun track for sure. One of my favorites. I know some people don't like it, but it's one of the ones you'll see every war pretty much. As oh, we playing with fire there, barely yeah. being underneath the thing. I know. Yeah, with, with when it comes to TM, I'm I'm really neutral about it, you know. But it's definitely one that that is played just about every war. So, mm. see what you mean. so yeah, it looks like uh, BRE in uh, one four at the moment. Looks like SX putting a lot of pressure on Saru to hold hold down the fort in, in front. So. We'll see how long that lasts. Yeah, I think yeah, that I think we see a little bit of a uh, character diversity here today, which is kind of nice. So I think yeah, the DK totally. is Roberto from from SX. We know Wario being John, the classic Wario user, and then Sorry, the, uh, um, Dry Bowser. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah, that'll be interesting. So good stuff. Was... Yeah, Sorry getting blued out. So it looks like might be SX in top two, but BRE just about everything after. Yeah, going for a critical back here, Reese. I don't know if that connected. I don't think it did. It looks like Bree is able to cut up. He actually lost four spots there from the cut on lap three, which is quite a lot. Oh, man, it was like one, one five him. at the moment for SX, but uh, yeah. two, three, can four we... for for BRE. And you think Reese has a bomb in fifth, so maybe he can make a play here. As we're, yeah, he still got that bomb. He actually far might have gotten sniped. And yeah, this is a big situation to get a snipe here on the top path. He's gonna go for it. Getting oh, both. Nice. That's perfectly wow. done. Oh, and gets getting... rid it out for it. Oh man. It for it. Yeah, unfortunately, <laughs> he just pulled a shroom there, but yeah. Oh, it looks like a top two, Ooh. at least, for BRE. Yeah, top two, five, six. Yeah, it's definitely a winning oh. race for BRE. So even at that uh. box, they're able to hold on to the top two, so well done. 
Um, I, I don't blame Reese for going for that. That that was a highlight moment there, and he got it. it yeah, did not work I, out I, for him. yeah. It's just it's really unfortunate that he pulled a shroom after, and he could not protect against that red that was behind him. I think he was thinking too far in the front and trying to trying to say, "All right, I'm going to get first here if I bomb these guys <laughs> out." Didn't think about looking behind him to see if there was a red, but you know, it is what it is. <laughs> yeah, from my personal experience, you know, I. Yeah, I, I, looking back solves like 80% of the problems in this game that you're going to have. <laughs> that <laughs> is true. That is true. <laughs> you know, I'm no, I'm no D1 expert though, so. Yeah. Um, even with the new format, I'm still not D1, so don't 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 take that from me, but <laughs> but uh that's yeah. that's there you go. I mean, when you're in third, there's nine people behind you, so you do got a point with 80%. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So. <laughs> So that's a plus 14 for Bree, so uh, off, to, off to a good start for them, winning their first yet to lose here in the, in the winner's final. And as you said, going for that first tournament win and their first appearance would be pretty nice. Um, yeah, do you know if World Friend Star was in this tournament at all? I I didn't check the bracket beforehand, that's my bad, but um, don't they know where were. they were. They were, but I don't know exactly where in the bracket they were. I, I haven't looked at the, uh, the standings recently. Yeah, so I'm a little surprised to not see them. I'll try to pull that up here, but we later on. But we do have uh, the classic bagging GBA. Mark. Oh, I do remember they lost to BRE by four, so I think that they're going to be in losers finals. Okay. Yeah. So that's Eight. yeah. So a good so, chance yeah. loser of this game will play against World Friend. That's correct. Yeah. Uh, that's actually a statement win there for Brie as well. You know, two French teams but totally. able to to come together. Maybe World Friend. Kind of falling off, you know. Hopefully not too much. There, you know, they won six straight titles, and after losing the Requiem, trying to make a statement Crazy. here again in this tournament. Yeah, and they they picked up a lot of players from Requiem, so it's kind of like they're they're a super team now. But uh, <laughs> it's really interesting that they lost to BRE. Yeah. So that last race was a uh, totally, totally. That last race was a plus fourteen for uh, John Messiah, so they're kind of in the lead right now. But you know, we'll see if they can hold on to it for now. We see Roberto in the back as well as I think that's Saru for, for Bree. So one of each mm -hmm. team going for the, the rod as the blue comes out for, for Roberto. So I don't think XX has a shock. Maybe Saru does in the very back. As that's what's going to come down to here is ooh, multiple players. John and Bree's getting taken out. But I think Saru might have it. He hasn't used anything in a long time. Yeah. Let's see if they're able to, able to do as the blue gets yeah. dodged in first. I'm almost certain that he has it back there as he's not even taking the NIST. So. <laughs> We'll see. Yeah, but do they need to use it? Looks like they might be in good spots. Is ooh, we're getting back by his own teammate, I think. Well, it sucks because it looks like BRE does not have any dodges, so there's really no point to even use it. Or they might that's... even be holding blue. Oh, and that's no. a good, that's a great ghost pull for Reese. He's able to steal ooh. second place. Top two for SX, man. Yeah, top two for five. How about that? So good response. It might even been, it might even have been a disconnection for for Saru because I know that's that he's true. been he's been known to disconnect a lot, so. So I'm, mm. I'm not sure if that's that's kind of why. But yeah, if there was no shock in play, then then I can imagine it might have been a bot back there. Yeah, for sure. And that's a unfortunate, well, a good, a good ghost there from from Reese, able to pull in a second. Otherwise, he would have gotten horned on the NISC. And so, yeah, good response from Secret X taking the lead now by by eight. So, it's, yeah, here we go, game on, for sure. Oh, and I love this track pick that uh that Bree is going for. Really, and I'm, hot, I, I'm I hate it. it. I hate it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Man, I have no idea how to play that track besides just don't get hit. You know. Yeah. That's there you go. You go. And we're gonna see it happen. So. Yeah. Oh man. <laughs> yeah, it's it's really really good. Yeah. So Saru Saru did Saru did in fact disconnect. But um, it, I think that this track is really really good if you're starting in 11th or 12th, but nothing else. <laughs> That's uh, that is why I pick it. In, in a Fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah. And yeah, the first two uh, items on this track was uh, Vara missing the star boost there. Actually, might be a strat because you can draft on this hill, and uh, at least not gonna be able to yeah. do so in first place. But there is a huge, huge, huge inward advantage on this track. Oh, it's it's just it's really really good for inward. Yeah. And to your point, Reese getting a draft up, not getting red right. somehow. Yeah, that was a really weird red that skipped right there. So he's he's at the top right now. If he pulls a oh, he pulls a shroom, which might even be better for him. Oh, he yeah. Out, he's in the top. Ooh, not getting Risk, a sniper. Risky play there. Yeah. Yeah. Not yeah, getting punished for that. Getting back for that, for that red on TM. So. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It looks like 
It's like a top top two ish for BRE yeah, right now. Yeah, top two ish. <laughs> so yeah, it's, yeah. It's trail. Oh, oh, look at Palm going really slow. Let some of his teammates oh, sneak ahead. Oh, that's a top four. I think that's a top four for Bree. Oh, and it's yeah. gonna be even bigger. Bre oh wow, yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of carnage going on in the mid pack. Oh man. <laughs> Yeah, there's a lot of SX back there. They're gonna need the full shock, and they're gonna need it now. <laughs> yeah, as you see, one of the wallet we just no, maybe not stopping. I'm gonna get some lag. You know, they're getting hit as well. So yeah, you can't take shortcuts in this track, and if, yeah. even with the blue shell, we'll see. As LMDS for B, maybe wrapping up a top four. Ooh, the back. That's gonna be interesting to see. Uh, there was one player that I didn't see their see? tag. Ooh, they got planted out of the sky. So oh, he's here. in the first, so that might have been a top four for B or top three for BRE. So. So we'll have to see. Yep, and indeed it was, but there's a couple of them back there, 8, 10, 12, rounding up the bottom. So kind of nullifies it a little bit, but top three is a winning race no matter what. So Yeah. Yeah, and Trainbow Road coming to work for them. as It's going to be a close match after three. So we got ourselves a game here today. So we love to see it. No, this is no Japan-Mexico. This, this is a close game, two-point game after three. So. And then you have your experience with the, the blowout, the blowout games. So. I know, and we do have, we do have a war. Yeah. It's gonna be interesting. Tough, yeah. As yeah. MPU starts in just a couple weeks, so we're uh, excited to bring the new format of the season, which will probably explain more in the next casts, but oh, excited man, to be back yeah. on MPU Central. I'm super excited for MPU. It's going to be a really fun season. Yeah. I'm, I'm really excited to implement that new format for sure. I, I like kind of the, uh, Shifting within divisions and stuff, I think that's going to be really fun to, to see kind of just how everything works out. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Mm -hmm. And this this tournament as well, having a new format with not every team playing in the same bracket right away. So it kind of, you know, lack of competition levels being being kind of a, a problem in, in these tournaments. But this tournament did well, did a good job at putting the best teams against each other right away. Yeah, every totally. team that played gets to play, gets to play, you know, a, a good match. So yeah, shout out to the staff for that. Yeah, I like that too. And it was it was really really good to see proceedings, kind of just how how close teams can be to each other, and and you know <laughs> teams that were expected to do really well kind of getting blown out just a bit. So it was it was really an interesting uh, tournament in that in that regard. Mm -hmm. You a big uh, Prana Plant Slide fan, Miles, or no? What you... oh, I like it. I think it's a lot of fun. It's um when I when I play on inward, it's it's a really good runner, but I also kind of like it using Wiggler. It's, it's, it's a, it's a good runner. <laughs> it's good in front. I agree. Yeah. As a what do you, user, what do you think? By, you know, as a scooter user, I do like it as well. So. Okay. As, as, it's like a, putting some cuts in the back there, but or, bananas in the Ooh. cut. Ooh. Able to get Varo. Nice, nice. And get, Ooh, able to get Ooh, and Reese get the trail. Looks like a top two at the moment. Yeah. Yeah. Well, good, good the right red, there. getting JB off on the cut. <laughs> oh. Well, that was risky of JB to do that, so I don't like it, but uh, it's like a top three at the moment for BRE. Yeah, reason to go for a side snipe. Gonna get Varo on the... Oh! Oh, <laughs> oh man, that is... Oh, wait. Oh, I think that might have been lag. It might have been lag, but oh, it looked yeah. like it. It really looked like it. <laughs> that was funny. Oh, man. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh! Oh, that was really lucky. And that's a good I think, pull I think that green hit me. banana. Yeah, that's a really good pull. It's got a horn. Unable to... Let's see if we can get up to the LMDS here. Maybe not. Uh, looks like LMDS preparing for a back here. Yep, and he was. Another one. And getting oh, clipped by the blue. Oh, oh the blue taking him out. Oh, that's going to be two BRE going out, and it's just going to be Pumpkin Tail holding him down the fort. Yeah, Reese, yeah, looking for that shroom here in second for sure. Totally. Was, I thought maybe a shot could be in play, but now the pack a lot closer than it was. Mm -hmm. It's like a 2 3. Yeah, I think it's one, one more have. shot. One more shot to pull a shroom. So, we'll for see. Sure. And the back will. Oh, he's going to throw the bananas up. Alright. Minefield and then it's not going to be Yeah. Oh, yeah. This could Ooh. be good. This could be a good one. Looks like the red broke on something. One, two, and he's like, oh, he's got one more throw. Oh, but he gets back! Oh! oh. <laughs> it didn't really matter. Yeah. Well, oh, yeah. Oh, man. Falling from second <laughs> all the way to nine. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Yeah, losing a few spots to BRE, but looks like a two, three, four, five at the moment for SX. So that was good for them, but... Pumped too. I was able to hold down the fort and that back on the last turn. That was really, really great. Yeah. He knew that all he had was that boomerang, so he was able to freely back, you know, without fear of red shells. Yeah. And it's a winning race for a Secret X, though. So. Yeah. Palm is really killing it this war. You know, I think that he's really got something to prove here. <laughs> so, 
and it's really good to see him with the crown for sure. <laughs> and I, I love his me too. <laughs> oh it's yeah, great. the classic. Yeah. I remember my very first season of um, MKU, I think it was season, uh, I want to say 10 or 11? When I was on MKO and we were in Division 9, I remember uh, Palm was on this team called Infinity, which was like a lower division French team, and he was like their carry. So I think it's really, really interesting to see his climb all the way up to, to Platt and Lounge and uh, in this Division 1 team, DRE. So. I think that's a really, really cool uh, kind of underdog story, for sure. Yeah, for sure, yeah. Yeah. And I believe that was a John Messiah pick there, DKJ. Mm -hmm. They only have first, though. They have, like, first and sixth, so it's kind of an yeah. awkward, awkward start for them. Yeah, one six is an awkward spot to start in, for sure. Mm -hmm. We get to watch our, our inward struggle on the super bounce. But, uh. <laughs> Ooh, that'd be yeah. awesome. That was a weird green. I saw yeah. that. But... Yeah, pushing up very well. It looks like Pump Shear's gonna get red. It's so. Su uh, Ooh. Screw that. You know what I said about struggling? He's in first place. Right, totally. Your SX. Yeah, it doesn't even need that super bounce. He's all the way up from the front. <laughs> yeah, it looks like LMDS is up here as well. So it's gonna be a top, an inward top two on DKJ. Which yeah, is yeah, what? Well, What's exactly yeah. pulling double shroom is probably not what you wanted to pull. We'll see if John is aggressive with the greens in third. And he's on him. Oh, oh, I think, oh, I think I Bruce just fell off at first. Yeah, oh, that's, that's unfortunate. Man, if this green doesn't hit on the side. We have a run with the shroom here for, for oh, LMDS. and a shroom and defense. That's gonna be really perfect for LMDS in the front, yeah, yeah. but uh, yeah, losing some time with the super rounds for sure. John with a bomb right behind him, and he's able to get the sneak red. That's oh. good. That's well done. That was, yeah, that was. But uh, yeah, we're yeah. coming out. Good for, for it. Okay. Yeah. I thought that was really interesting with the bomb. It looked like he just threw it off. Yeah. <laughs> I, I thought he was going to make a play with the bomb, but he just chose to go for the red instead. Yeah, so it looks like, you know, a lot, very spread out pack. So we haven't seen any shots yet this war, I don't think. So maybe we see one here. Uh, very yeah, we have one that's, that's a good point. That's a good point. We really haven't seen the shots. Yeah. Not like that's an important item or anything. It's, we head up to lap three here. Oh yeah, totally. But uh, yeah, it's it's really interesting. It seems like both teams are just really confident. Oh, and a shot coming out. Yeah. Looks like I I think that Ooh. might have been An SX shot. Looks yeah, like I want to say so, but I think yeah. uh, um, Saru dodged in the back, so it got me thinking that it might have been a BRE shot, but I'm not sure. We'll have to see who's who's in the front right now because it is a Waluigi and it's hard to tell. Yeah, I, th I saw Varo for SX pulling up there with the dodge, so they might have yeah. some good spots. And yeah, we kind of lost, we lost sight of the front after after John fell out. So and he's getting red on the turn, actually, the Wario. Oh, Ooh, that's not good at all. Yeah, that's not he good. He might get a lot him of, last. Looks like a lot of mid spots for BRE. We'll see if they're able uh, to get the top spots. They're not. Oh, oh yeah, top two, five, six, seven for BRE. So in wow. fact, that might have been a BRE shock. I'm not sure. Might have been. Yeah, we. Let's see, let's see what the Twitch chat thinks of who shocked that was, but yeah, way, BRE taking the lead after five. Totally. Yeah, yeah so, so we're here we're here in the Twitch chat. Strong start from Palm, thought he might be one of the weaker members in this lineup. I totally agree. You know, it's really interesting to see him kind of doing so well in a room like this. So it really show it really it shows just how much he's improved and, and how he's learned from the players that he's playing with. So it's really, really fun to see for sure. Yeah. And if you go in with that mindset into a room that, you know, these players are better than me, I'm not going to do well, then, you know, that's not a good mindset to have, you know, why don't you totally. go, especially in a team format, it's a lot different than, than, a, than a Mogi. So yeah, so good for, that's good why, for them. Yeah. You know? That's why it's always beneficial to, to play with players that are, you know, better better than you on paper, because you have a lot to, to take away from it and a lot to learn, so. 100%. Yeah. But I think that's four track picks in a row now for Bree as they take a, a 18, point, 18 point lead after five, so. Yeah, wow. I think I did say XX would win by 18, so. So far, not <laughs> yeah. <pretty> good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they get a bunch of ties, and <laughs> it's mm -hmm. kind of the opposite. Yeah. I think the first place guy burned out, so that's, you know, that's a, that's a rip. Yeah, it is. Dragon first for, for SX. Gonna get sniped? Yes! Oh, oh. Banana. 
<laughs> oh man, I think that was a scar attack snipe. That was insane. But yeah, yeah, top two right now for BRE. Another, yeah, you're never safe here in these rooms. Totally. No matter what position you're in. Totally. They're gonna go for everything that they can. And we'll see if John's able to get around this nano that LGS is holding. These two former team mats going playing. So maybe some cat and mouse right here. He has the red. <laughs> Oh, going for that, yeah, going for the risky bat. Okay. Right? Just have the defense after. Yeah. Ooh, oh man. Okay. Double red. So that was that was a really clutch pull, and that was a really risky play for for yeah. LMDS, But I'm glad that it worked out, and they're able to hold their top two. Pulling Shroom and Horn. That's pretty much just about the best thing you can pull right now. Yeah, and they almost uh, John going for another Nana snipe there. Mm -hmm. Almost able to connect. Getting the four tricks even with that weird glider. So that's interesting. Having to, having to use the horn and the shroom, unfortunately, and he's gonna have no defense. He will get double redded out here. Oh, yeah. man, unfortunate. So yeah, it looks like a 2-3 right now, almost, for SX. And uh, it's just gonna be VRE in first, and that's it for now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the, the dry Bowser is on VRE, right? That's Saru, so... Maybe, correct, correct. If anyone's gonna have the stock, it might be him. Hopefully he didn't DC. Yeah, it's gonna be hard to say. Yeah, 2-3-4 right now for, for SX, and Faro looks like he's getting redded out there. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, so, so BRE looking like 140, 145, with the fire yeah. on the right side. Oh, go for the back. Oh, man. Oh, oh, man. Yeah, he did. That was, oh, that's punish. <laughs> man, there's a lot of punishing going on in this room for sure. Yeah, yeah he spammed all of his fire up only to get back by the red on from Reese. That's, oh, just so unfortunate. But yeah, it looks like it might have been a 1-4 from BRE as they were able to hold down the first. Yeah, 1-4-6, but a 2-3-5. Pretty even race for, for both teams. No, very even race there. So, yeah, just yeah, it's a game of risk and reward. If you throw your backs, if you, mm -hmm. try, if you try to snipe people, you might get back. So, mm -hmm. that turn on TikTok is one of my least favorite, least favorite parts. The one after the box is it's so underrated, but you can get back there so easily. Yeah, and um, that is a two point win for Secret X actually, despite not getting first. So, find themselves down 16 now, halfway through. Yeah, this match. yeah. So, like I said, it was a really close race, but um, I did not even notice. As people are pointing out in the Twitch chat, there's a pink gold peach on the map, and that was Roberto. So, I don't know if he's going to be sticking with that character selection, but it's going to be interesting as as we have a lot of diversity going on now. Yeah, good to see, yeah. Totally. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, Swamp Ruins coming out, which is a really interesting track pick for 1-4, for but uh, I do see a lot, of, a lot of teams picking that for, for like, the first and nothing else. I do like it actually. I do like. I hope to see it. And we got to see Trainbow. Maybe we get to see some Swamp Ruins as well. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, it looks like we're not getting it right now. No. <laughs> getting another track pick that we see just about every war. A little, <laughs> so. a little less exciting pick in Dolphin Shoals. <laughs> right, right. I don't know. I, li I like Dolphin Shoals. Doing doing the glider strat at the end's a lot of fun. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. Mm -hmm. uh, Still, no one, no one really gave me a definitive answer who shocked that was on DKJ. So, yeah, um, we, <laughs> I think we had no idea, honestly. Yeah, could have been, could have been either way. It looked like SX as, as far was coming up, but it ended up being a BRE top two, so it really could have been either way. Yeah. Uh, oh, unfortunate bumps there. Are we just gonna try to trail him off the pipes here. Oh, we'll get the red out anyway. So, red, yeah, red them instead. Yeah. John getting taken out in the first, so mm -hmm. it looks like Sorrow in first place at the moment, maybe mm -hmm. not anymore. Yeah, a lot, a lot of carnage coming out for Reese. He's, he's taking names for sure. Yeah, <laughs> yeah the, the DS, you know, it's such a chaotic track, lap one, especially at that eel. And, you know, we still don't really know who's in the top because our, our POVs are in 5 6. It's like um, DS might be able to ret to Ghost Red one of them. Oh, he does. He yeah, gets oh, yeah. It's Oh, Maybe no, not. he doesn't, actually. Oh, uh, he backs Reese with the fire. That's good. Yeah. Uh, not sure who's in first, but it is uh, second for SX and third for, for BRE. Really hard to say. It's just a while to but the blue's coming out. Hopefully, we'll be able to see soon who was in first. Uh, Draken, oh. clipped by the blue. I think so, yeah. <laughs> Having to <laughs> panic through the green there. Is, uh, Reese being fired again, so... Right, <laughs> right. <laughs> It looks like it, that might have been a Breen first. I, I have a feeling, and it's one four five <laughs> if that's the case. Man, he is whoever whoever's in front, really broken away. Yeah, but, uh, yeah. Like, ooh, I think I'll, he hit his own teammate there. Oh, I yes. wanna, <laughs> I wanna say it's Bjorn first as, as uh, what's his name? LMDS was trying to slag whoever was in third with the with the red there. 
wasn't wasn't yeah. going for the snipe and, and just letting uh, whoever's in first just kind of break away. Yeah, you'll see that getting a star in fifth place, it's one of the cleaner runs you'll see. I wanna, first. I wanna say it might be Scar Tap. But coming in, and that's Ooh. gotta be an SX shock. You oh, saw multiple yeah. SX dodging. Yeah. Yeah. And it looks like yeah. they target shocked first place as well. Oh, wow. Who was it Darky? Was that Darky? Oh, that it might have been Darky in front. It was. Oh. oh first only. <laughs> oh man, that was that was unfortunate. Must have been. wow. I have no clue. Again, we have no idea who shock that is, but it might have been a BRE shock. Which shot? One, one no. One four five for BRE. <laughs> and so another close race here. So this match is this match is down coming down to the wire. It really is. It's something you love to see. Yeah, totally. And that's another two point winning race for Secret X. So after all that, potentially mm -hmm. their shock, you know. We'll see. Yeah, it looks but... like looks like it was a. Uh, I think it was just Reese predicting uh, BRE shock. That's kind of my guess. But yeah, it looks like that was another plus two for Secret X. So John Messiah is only up fourteen at the moment. Yeah. Again, it is coming down to the wire, continuing to come down to the wire. Oh man, two interesting picks on the board. <laughs> Great, two fantastic track picks uh -oh. on the board right now. <laughs> I'm excited to see this. <laughs> this got me on the edge of my seat for sure. I want to see both of these tracks in play. Yeah, so people saying they got they got Roberto on, out of the star. So shout out to to those of you figuring that out. Mm -hmm. So we'll, we'll credit that shock to Bree, as we're not yeah. going to see Thwomp Ruins, we're going to see Moving yeah. Meadows. And Darky is confirming that it was a BRE shock, as he was TS at first. So. Okay. Yeah, that sucks. Being so broken away and, and losing just to a TS, that's just, it's really yeah. unfortunate when that happens. Yeah. And speaking of a track where there's not going to be a TS, probably not on this one. <laughs> we see a top four in... Yoshi bike. So what? What is going on? It's a revolution. Yeah, man. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. So all four of our inwards were in the top four that race. So. Yeah. As we're getting that draft. So you know, this track all about this cut right here on the left. Because none of our top three are going to be able to take it. Yeah. But John taking it for for Secret X. He's going to he's going to pull it. Well. It looks yeah. like a top three right now, but it's a very volatile top three because yeah. look how close this pack is. Oh my God, the pack is so close. It looks like Sarv about a DC. Look how far back he is. Yeah, it looks like he's yeah, looks like, the map here. Yeah, it looks like we're playing a 5v6. Oh, wow, yeah, he's just kind of teleporting just, right now. Just, yeah, viewer ah, discretion that's... advised. Yeah! yeah. That, that's unfortunate for sure. Yeah, I, don't, I do not think the Saru's back. I think that he might be <laughs> in the pack on his screen, but on our screen, he's yeah, just we have, all over the place. He is just playing another game right now. It looks like <laughs> totally. three, four... For Bree, I believe that's an SX top two. You kind of lost sight of first. Getting a this trail on Bree. Oh, man. Yeah, it's unfortunate. Trails like that can kind of just end your race. Oh, if it's Snipe. Only, only hitting one BRE there, I think. Yeah, and LMGS actually kind of cut the grass there, but he's able to hit about seven people there with a the boomerang. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone else is dying. Fortunately, a couple of them might have been his teammates, so. Yeah, it looks like a 2 3 with Roberto and John. And, and if that's an SX in first, this could be a, a, a lead changing race. As a ghost in triple reds here, wow, oh, whose ghost is that? Is SSX, is Reese able to get a star on somebody? Maybe not. He's avoiding all this stuff, though. Yeah, it could have potentially been a top three for SSX. We'll have to see who was, yeah, who was the first. Be, yeah. Yes, it is. And it yes, was. Sir. Top three, six for SSX. That's going to really kind of flip things around right now. Man. I'm going to, I forget whose pick that was, but it worked out well for SSX, so. It did. So, hopefully it was theirs. And they're going to, let's make see what the score is now. There's... Yeah, I'm pretty Shout sure that was an SX pick. You think? You think it was an SX pick? I, I do, I do, and it, it did seem to work out for him. Yeah, it's a 24-point win for Secret X. They now take a 10-point lead going into our last GP. Yeah, totally. And uh, I know you like this track on the screen. I, I think you're a fan of this, aren't you? Oh, I am. I love Grumble. It looks like uh, <laughs> Damien actually subbed in for Saru. So oh, okay. yeah, that's uh, so that's who I'm seeing right now. With the me that looks like my old me, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> that's true, that's true. Maybe you're, you're not playing and casting at the same time. That'd be kind of interesting. Right, right, yeah. I know. It'd be a little too difficult to communicate with my team. <laughs> yeah, shout out to our uh, our stream host, Dylan, today for doing all the work behind the scenes. So. Right, right, um, totally. They, do, they make it yeah. easier for us. So when we get that uh, that grumble pick. So. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, it sucks that, that Sarah had had quite a few DCs. He might have had like two or three, but yeah, I think that <laughs> it'd be smart of his team to kind of limit him to to one or two DCs per war, and, and then he get, he gets kicked out of lineup. <laughs> so yeah. it would make sense. 
You know, it's unfortunate as he is one of their better players, but, you know, connection just it isn't great all the time. It's how yeah. it is. It is how it is. So it's, uh... LMDS gonna bag immediately. I think we're having some stream delay from Reese's side. Don't know mm -hmm. if we're gonna be able to switch to him. Hopefully we can. That looks okay so far. Maybe yeah. he's a little behind. But in the pack, ooh, getting. Okay, he's safe. Is, nah, the... is he behind I think, Dark? I think Gearing? it's fine. I think it's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we see... Oh, we see four of the top five occupied by SX right now, actually. So... Oh, wow. Ah, they're in the top five right now. Oh, ooh. Okay. I don't know, BRE kind of sneaking into the, the yeah. fourth spot there, it looks like. That's in top 3, 5, 6 it looks like. But this is a track where a shot can make a world of a difference here. Totally. Yeah, cool. bagging this track is... Oh, that was a really close snipe. <laughs> yeah, ba bagging this track can really prove to be beneficial for sure. But, uh, you know, sh shot can be kind of hard to pull, as it's... It becomes a little bit more difficult to, to catch up once you're, once you're bagging so hard, but, you know... Yeah. We'll see if, uh... SX is able to get the shot as uh, LMBS is sneaking a star into a high spot. He's gonna use it, and the shot coming in, so that's yep. gotta be a brief yep. shot. Gotta be, gotta be, yep. That was really perfect. As soon as he used that star, I was like, here it comes, and yeah. there it is. We yeah, have sure man defense at first. He is, yeah. he is. Having a little bit of, of a break, too, so that's gonna be really good for him. Yeah, so let's see if we can switch back to, to Reese, if that's, if that's possible. Yeah, thank you very much. Let's see. Oh, no, no. Okay, so. A lot more going on in the pack as you'd expect. Just oh man. Coming. Left and right. It's gotta be frustrating. Oh, oh man. <laughs> Can I ghost? Okay, I'm ghosting guys. I have to, you know. <laughs> yeah. yeah. One of those situations. Literally. Man, it really sucks. So it looks like we're gonna get the runaway first, or LMDS that is. Oh, but another Ooh, shot coming another in. Another shot right? coming in, yeah. Looks like an SX dock, dock. yeah. Two, two oh, SX dodging up. I wonder if that's gonna matter and Ooh, they're that's... gonna be able to sneak in the front. I, yeah, maybe not. Uh, no, it looks looks like they will be able to get yeah. the top two right here. Top two, yeah, 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 top two. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> that is really unfortunate. Dodging the shock and being so set up in front only to get third. It's just not really what you want to see. But yeah, top two, Ooh. five, six, bottom two for SX. So it's gonna be kind of a kind of a mixed race, but it is overall, I think, a, a win for SX. They're yeah, able to kind of. Continue their uh, game. Wasn't as devastating of a win as uh, as we, as you might have thought it was, but both shocks coming into play there. It's mm -hmm. actually an eight point win for Secret X. So now they're up by eighteen points. So Ooh. you know, I'm starting to feel a little better about my prediction. <laughs> races to yeah. go. He really flipped the script there. It's crazy. Yeah, yeah classic it. classic French pick coming in for for Bone Drive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna give a shout out to uh, my teammate Marcus. He's a huge uh, Bone Drive fan, so mm. don't know if he's watching the stream today, but he's turned me on to a big, be a fan of it as well. So, track is so fun. I love it. Yeah, it's a really good draft right now. It's really good when you're in front too. It's just fun to play, <laughs> especially when you're on Scooty. It's it's just kind of fun to break away. All those tight turns and everything just becomes so much easier on Scooty. Yeah. But the commentator curse, we're not going to get it. We're going to get Dude. the boring Dude. RWS for Secret. Yeah. The yeah, hardest like... runner of the game. Yeah. Been that way since, what, 2014, right? So. Yeah, totally. That's, that's, things don't change. Some things never change. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but uh, we got three races left. Let's see if John Messiah is able to flip the script once more. Or if that's able to hold their lead. Yeah. yeah. Do you stream right here? Yes, okay. Yes, you do. Of course. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> I'll lead just a bit. Yeah. Who cares about coins when you can just break low with the shroom right there? Yeah. We'll even double for his teammate. Smart play. Mm -hmm. Oh, and the defense, anyways, does not matter. Oh, oh getting, getting bumped, bumped by, by his teammate. Oh, that's yeah. really unfortunate. Looks like, yeah, it looks like a 2 3 4 for. Oh, maybe not. 2 3 mm. at least for free. Yeah, how are things going to shape up here? Is, uh, is Breeze the one that needed need to not lose this race by too much if they want to stay in it? Yeah, totally. Yeah. Yeah, Biari kind of needs to pull out all the stops here if they want to kind of get away a little a good bit. Trail. I think he trailed Reese there. So that's a good oh, trail nice. there. Oh, nice. Yeah. It's a lot of SX up here. Running Biari out of fifth? I think it was. Yeah. Missing the chain there is not, not going to help. But mm -hmm. I don't know who's in the top two. I kind of lost track, but if that's... Assuming it's not a top four for Secret X, there's no way it can be a top four. Or can it? I don't know. There's a bar up here as well. I'm gonna slow down. 
in that eighth place box, and yeah, you can see how much different eighth place boxes are. We're going for the ghost string, string in the car. Interesting, interesting strat. <laughs> I wonder, I wonder why he did that, but uh, yeah, it didn't really matter. And he was able to kind of use those reds to his, to his advantage for a little bit. Yeah, so Reese is actually in a very good spot now. There is somebody in last. Oh, I take that back. He's not in that good of a spot now. <laughs> Pretty sure it's still Drac in the front. It looks like uh it's yeah, like yeah, still yeah. in two three. It might be even a top four or top five for for SX. Ooh. This would be this could be this could be a game set match here if they get this top totally, five. Totally, totally. Yeah, this could be really good for them. It doesn't go for the double chain, so he might lose a spot here to the cut. Oh, but man. those greens are actually a really good pull. So he might go for a snipe here. BRE sticking in the fifth, but it might have been like a top three top four for for, for SX. Yeah, and it yeah. was. Man. Dang. Yeah, yeah so sorry. we're starting to really put it away here. Yeah, good call on that Drac, because I completely forgot that was Drac who, who took over the lead in the first lap. So that was a very big race. Now, Breed in trouble now. They are. As they are. They need something uh, big, and they need it now. Yeah, the loser of this game will go on to play in the loser's final. And we'll look up that matchup before this ends. But this is the, uh, this is the MK Frontier Gold bracket winner's final game. Winner of this is one win away from winning it all, actually. Yeah, totally. so. And yes, it's a 42 point lead now with two to go. So Bree now in trouble. They're going to need a big race here to give themselves a realistic shot. They're down, looks like a lot. A lot. Looks like I think they're down 42. Yep. Around there, man. Been fortunate for them. Yeah, so we'll see if they have it in them to get a big win. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and actually the loser of this game will play either high definition KT2. Big shout out to Kira Team 2 for getting an upset over Arcadia earlier today. Uh, World Friend Star or Team Main Clan. Um, so the loser's bracket's still going on right now, actually. So KT2's gotten really, really strong. Yeah, they really yeah. They, they put ABA away <laughs> uh, yesterday. It was a really insane match. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're 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 cracked. They're pretty good now. <laughs> yeah, so getting that bone dry pick that we much desired. So we'll see if this is what this is what we'll see if they're able to break in. I I was this was this a brief pick despite having not top. It was. I, it was a brief pick. Interesting. Is they yeah, SX, SX picked Water Park for their top four. Okay. That is known to be their track for sure. Oh, getting, oh, getting, a, getting the trail really? out. Yeah. LMD is able to sneak away into the front. Very important for them for sure to hold this top spot. He's gonna go for the duck. Looks like he's going top path here to get the extra box. Yeah. Smart play. It's actually, it's actually oh, faster. Oh, he doesn't even get the box. Get the box, yeah. yeah. It's, it's just faster to go that way. Than is it really? I didn't yeah. know that. Yeah. And yeah, it looks like one. Oh, maybe not. Just like just first right now, we got Varro and Darky right on his tail. Does he put yeah. the bomb back? Because this is this, you know. Yeah, he does. And yeah, he's gonna get Darky. Yeah. We want to get ready for it now. Oh, he gets a horn. Oh, uh, pulls a horn, but has yeah. to use it immediately. That's unfortunate. Yeah. yeah this is one of the tracks that the shot can absolutely play play a part in. As we see a very spread out pack. Remember, yep, there it is. And a, indeed, a, there it is. Yep. It looked like it target shocked a lot of SX over the cannon, though. So maybe I don't know. We didn't see it from that POV, but it looks like it might have been a breeze shot. I think it was a breeze shot. Yeah, it looks like they wanted to get uh, LMDS in the top half, but uh, I'm not sure who dodged up in the, in the first there. Might be yeah, BRE. One can only hope it's BRE with how much they're down right now. Yeah, BRE needs the winning, needs a big race here. As we see a bottom two for Secret X. Yeah. And so that's a good sign for BRE. Mm -hmm. Damien's falling off at 11. Oh, that's Ooh. unfortunate. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah so they're going to be in a lot last. of SX back here, but yeah. uh, BRE in last, so. Yeah, multiple SX. I think our, our, our other POV, Bree's in second, so. Yeah, it looks, looks like, like they're going a top two. Does he go top for a two. chain here? Yeah, he does. Oh, if they can hold off Varro here, Varro's going to be taking the cut in third. Oh, he's unable to hold off. Oh, oh, oh he did it. Oh. Top two, nice. Good play. Okay. I don't know if that'll be good enough to keep him in it, but we'll have it's to a start. See. Oh, yeah, it's a start. Two, four, five, six. Okay, okay. Ooh. All right, I'm on the edge of my seat now. Let's see how this shapes out. We have a match. It's coming down to the final race. We do indeed have that's a match. That's a clutch fire. That's a clutch fire. That's a four point difference there. And that's a 22 yeah. point winning race. Is wow. The... Yeah. <laughs> they're going to need another one of those. So I wonder what track they're going to be picking for this. Yeah.
They're only down, uh, looks like 20 right now. So they're going to need Back 22. 20. Yep. Yeah, they're going to need 22. Yep. And so they have to do exactly what they just did. Pull a shock, get in the front, fireballs on the line. If they do all that right, they might be able to pull this off. Otherwise, Secret X, that plus 18 is looking very realistic right now. Yeah. And uh, we'll see what, how it goes down. Yeah, I love matches like this when it really does come down to the last match. You know, it's not really a blowout or anything. It's a really close no. match. Yeah, shout out to both teams. Some high quality Mario Kart despite falling off in 11th place. But, you know, yeah, it happens to the best of us. So. Exactly. It does. It does. Not too upset. It happens to me too often, but, you know, I won't talk <laughs> about that. <laughs> For those of you that are uh, into stats like me, that's seven track picks to, to Bree and only five to Secret X. So... Just a fun fact as we go into our last race on Mount Wario. Yeah, BRE getting their track pick. I wonder if they'll be able to hold down their top spots. As that's kind of what they'll need. Yeah. Yeah, their top two is in a good position to run, but their uh, four, five, six is in a really good position to fall shrooms. So yeah, it's, it's it looks like LDS out. failing the start boost. I not this this first section is very critical now for them. As that's a very good pull. <laughs> Did not matter as he pulled the shroom, matter. able to sneak yeah. in the first. All part of the plan. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah. It looks like JB getting a breakaway, but Drac right behind him. So this, you know, a lot can go down these first these first slopes. Oh when we yeah. Go into the cave. Yeah. Very close pack. We have a lot of SX up here. They are not backing down. Yeah, for sure. It's like a one three. Oh, it, ooh, getting the, the trail on. Uh, looks like on Roberto there, the pink gold peach. Oh. They're gonna pay the price for it. It's very wide. Oh, oh. he's getting ready too. Yes, yeah, so we're losing sight of the front. The front very important. Yeah, the rough DIV is kind of hitting straight to the back. They're getting hit straight to the back, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like... Hey, we, we, we see it. There's a triple red pull coming. Oh, the man. Yeah. Gonna send some of these guys right to the back. Palm 2 Tier, you're dead. LMDS, you're dead. Yeah. yeah. That's not good for yeah. that. He, he, did he, <laughs> he did not need that double. So just like pull he just pulled some worse. Oh! Yeah. And getting the double snipe from him, mm -hmm. kind of, you know, punishment for sure. Yeah, we see 8-9 for Bree is, is LMD. Yeah. Is really a star. I, I don't think a shot's in play at the moment. It could be, though. Is the blue, blue coming, coming out? That might be that might be GG's for BRE if that was them at first. Yeah, don't, they weren't first when we last saw them, but it's been a while. Has Varg right. get hit out? Another, oh, but didn't oh. use a star, but you had a star. You could have used it, but oh, he didn't. Oh, man. I didn't know if he knew the red was coming for him. But yeah, yeah we, have, we have a lot of mixed spots back here. Yeah, that's oh, exactly shock? what was Secret there, X needs. Was there a shock? Oh, it looks like Tom was small. Interesting. Oh, I did not see that. So it looks like Secret X is going to be able to hold off this win, unless that's a top three. And If that's a top three, this becomes very interesting, but I don't think it is. Yeah, I think there might be GG's for BRE, but... Uh, we'll we'll see what three. happens. Oh, but oh, it's a top, the top three. Oh, top three, six, oh. not is that enough? Do the math. Somebody in the, in the chat, do the math I don't right know. Now. I don't know. Oh, my God, that's so close. That is so close. As, the, as Dylan frantically types in the scores here in our chat, and that's not enough. They're going to lose by two. Oh. And after all that, <laughs> Secret X survives to win by two. Oh, by man, two. By two. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> what a finish there. Oh, Secret X man. On by a thread. Wow. Wow, it really came down to the wire. And we did wow. get a, a plus two win for SX. So congrats to them for uh, winning the Frontier Gold winners finals it's gonna be really really good for them for for seedings for everything as this match shows just how close these two teams are even with disconnections and communication issues and everything still a close match for us today yeah imagine if sorry didn't dc on you know whatever mumu or whatever that was so yeah, yeah man so yeah apparently there was a shock there on mount wario so you were right you were right miles i, I did not yeah. see that i missed yeah. it i missed yeah. it yeah. How, how did we miss a shock did anyone else see that <laughs> i don't know but yeah totally <laughs> But yeah, so I guess I guess you know I I did predict SX to win, so I guess you know not to not to rub it in, but but either way, it was a very hard fought match for both teams. Mm -hmm. Completely. Yeah. Again, thanks everyone for tuning in to today's MKC Frontier Gold Winners Finals. That's quite a mouthful. But uh, <laughs> yeah, once again, congrats to SX for really clutching out the win by two. That's gonna be really really huge for them. So again, I am Miles. I'm Josh K. Thank you guys so much for tuning in.